Dim cards, dim card, dim cards, dim cards. We're gonna talk about dim cards today. So we're going, I, I wanna do this for a while. Finally doing it, I'm very happy. So first of all, if you are not subscribed, do me a huge favor and click that subscribe button. If you scroll down and that subscribe button is red, that means you are not subscribed to me. Either YouTube unsubscribed you to me or you thought you were and you weren't. Do that for me, do that for you. It really helps the channel grow. I think over, over like 72% of you are not subscribed, which I think is pretty nuts. I know that's kind of annoying when YouTubers say that, but I mean, I did it and you and, and subs like shot up. So a lot of you who are watching are not subscribed. So just, just telling you, just letting you know. I'm pretty sure you saw the thumbnail. Pretty sure you saw the title. We're going to be talking about the 10 ish. I think, I, I think I got a list of 10 dim cards that i desperately want to see in the digimon vital brace we're still running the vital brace we're still talking about the vital brace i like the vital brace okay i think it's a fun device i love it it's it's great there's still a lot that they can do with it and one of them is obviously the dim card expansion oh my god we're getting so many we're getting so many coming very very soon so first of all, another little thing. I am wearing another one of Cinnabali's shirts. If you want to check out his uh, his page, hopefully if I remember, I'll leave it in the description down below. But if it's not there, I made a post on my community tab with a link to his uh, his uh, spring. No, it's not spring tea. It's one of those. It's one of those print on demand shirt things. It's really nice. It's all of the. I gotta back up to show it. It is all of the Digimon on all of the OG. V pets, including volume six or version six, it's all the way down here. It's really cute. I love it. Tortomon's right there. Look at him. I I'm zoom in, zoom in on Tortomon. I don't care. Even if you can't see it, zoom in on him. Anyway, <laughs> we're gonna move right on. Uh, this is these are, again dims that I want because we're getting already a lot of dims that are getting announced and everything. So I wanted to make this video really quick so that one, if I get one right, I'm like, oh shit, I predicted the future. I'm, I'm a genius. I keep telling you guys this. Uh, and then if it's wrong, then I can tell you guys, okay, yeah, you know, I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm dumb. I can go either way. So yeah, here are the top whatever dim cards that I want in or on the Vital Brace. Let's start. I want a sister mon dim. I think what they could do, since it seems like dim are going to be released in pairs of two, there are some exceptions. There are the special metabots dim. There is the gotcha dim. We're not gonna. We're really gonna focus more on like the idea of this being like a, a dual system or maybe just a one-off. Uh, sister mon. There are two originally. There are three really because CL is a canon Digimon now. I think it'd make a really nice dim card. I don't know if I'd want them split up between two cards. You could do that. I would like if they were all in one card though, just a Sistermon dim card. I think it'd be really cute. They're really cute. Digimon. I really like their designs. I feel like they are, there is like a, a, a fan demand for those, you know, every, it's kind of like Pokemon where like uh, everyone, someone is someone's favorite Digimon. Although there's way more Digimon than Pokemon. So maybe that's not the case as it is with Pokemon, but still Sistermon is up there with something I really want to see in the future. Uh, again, whether it be like the Blanc and Noir split between two dim or just like a one-off dim that has all of them. Maybe also Chohakaimon can be in there. I don't know why I think of her when I think of them as well. But I feel like that could also fit in there as like maybe like the trash one or whatever. It's something like that, you know? I, I would really like that. I think that'd be really cool. Okay, so I wrote this list well before they started actually releasing DIM, and this technically already exists, but I can still request it because there's more that they can do with it. So I really want a Guillemon DIM. We, again, we already have one now, but it's a single line. The last you know, little bit actually is different. I think it's like Chaos Dukemon, Dukemon, and Medieval Dukemon, which is really cool. I like the fact that the Gotcha Dim have three different Megas for each Digimon. I think it's really cool. I still feel like there's, there's more you can do with that. So, you know, a full Guillemon Dim card with, you know, a branching line. You can add a bit more Digimon, sprinkle them in there. You could add, actually, no, maybe McGeeDramon is in there. Is McGeeDramon on there? I don't know. I'll have a picture of the line somewhere here. Uh, but I'm pretty sure that McGeeDramon might be already on there already. But even if he's not, or if he is a reason, still, 
I would like to see a full on Geomon dim card that has like a full 12 Digimon on it, including the, you know, the three uh, Megas that we got, or maybe even new ones that would fit with Geomon. I, I still would like to see that. Geomon is really cool Digimon. He's he's not like my favorite, like he is for some people, but I still like him enough for, for him to like, for, for me to want him to get a full dim card release. We're gonna uh, fix this because it, it looks really boring back here without the thing. Where's my charger? Oh shit. Even all messed up like that, it still looks pretty good, but let's, let's fix it. I really need to figure out something to keep this like locked down. It won't stay down. That just looks so much nicer, doesn't it? It really does. Even It's gonna fall down mid-video. No one's roasting me about it yet. I roast myself about it. Anyway, we're gonna move on. Of course, I mean, who would I be if I wasn't going to request this? I wanna trash my dim. I don't know, like, who would be the poster boy of it. I mean, of course, I guess Sukumon. You know, you put, not Sukumon, uh, Numemon on the, the actual card itself. I mean, it could really just be like a Numemon dim card. I think Numemon has enough forms that you could just do a whole line with just him. Finally make Betamon a thing because he's shown up in like a lot of promotional material, but he's not on any dim card we've seen yet. It's very strange. We keep seeing every time they tap into something in like the commercials and stuff that they fight a Betamon. Betamon's not on any dim card. When you when you do battles on the Vital Brace, it pulls from Digimon from the dim card you have loaded in and Betamon's not on there. Uh, it's kind of strange to me. So maybe Betamon would be the, the rookie for that because uh, Betamon is kind of like a bad care rookie. Uh, I don't know. Either make a new Baby 1 and Baby 2 using ex existing ones. You have like New Maimon, Shell New Maimon, Black King New Maimon, Gold New Maimon, Platinum New Maimon, all that stuff. You know, maybe some Monzaimons in there too. Just throw a bunch of Trashmon in one place. Chumon also, you know, put Chumon in there. Um, Edamon, you know, something like that, you know, all, all, all of the trashy ones, uh, either it be like, again, like f focusing on Numemon or it could focus on just Trashmons in general. Either way, I think that'd be a really fun thing. I love Trashmon. Again, I'm the Trash Lord. I think it'd be a really cool idea. I don't know if they would do it because I don't know people, I mean, people are starting to come around to liking a lot of the Trashmon, but I don't know if it would sell as well to the masses. I can see it being like an April Fool's dim card that they were like they will release on like next April Fool's week or week or day, you know what I mean? Next April Fool's Day, I can see them releasing it as like an April Fool's joke, but it being like a real product, a la the Metal Bot, Metal Bots, the Metabots dim card. I think it'd be really cool though, a, a trash dim card. I, I would really like to see that. Let's 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 make it happen, Bandai, please. I would like to, I'd like I'd like to see that. <laughs> I really like Tyrannomon. I think his line is really cool. I'm not a huge fan of metal Tyrannomon, but Tyrannomon itself, Dark Tyrannomon, and especially Rust Tyrannomon, some of my favorite Digimon. I really really like him. He's the original mascot of Digimon in general. Originally, if you don't know, my hair's a little fucked up. Looks like a Willy Wonka. You lose! Good day, sir. Anyway, Rust Tyrannomon is one of my favorite Digimon. He's really cool. If you didn't know, Tyrannomon actually was originally the mascot of Digital Monsters. He's in the logo for the original. Is he in the logo? Well, he's in the logo for the 20th anniversary. I don't know if he's in the original logo, but either way, he's on the packaging for the original Japanese V Pets. He was in a lot of stuff. He was pretty much supposed to be the original mascot for at least the V Pets. And then he ended up getting replaced by Agumon as the overall mascot. In general, there were actually like three mascots for Digimon there was Tyrannomon for the V Pets, Vidramon for the manga, and then Agumon for the anime, and then Agumon just became the overall mascot. But either way, Tyrannomon's the OG mascot, in my eyes. It would be really nice for him to get a dim card. He has enough forms to fill out a dim card. You have like a beginning to end. You, I think it'd be a really cool idea. Again, I like Tyrannomon. I think a lot of people like Tyrannomon too. So I don't feel like that would be a, 
a too far out there kind of idea for a dim card. Now, a lot of my dim card ideas are really Digimon focused instead of like general focus because it seems like what we're getting so far is you know there's the ex set which was just gabumon and agumon from adventure and then we every set we're getting so far is really kind of like the old school v pets where like they have a name like let's say impulse city right impulse city even though it's all new digimon they all fall under this umbrella of the impulse city kind of area so they all have a theme volcanic uh, volcanic beat all the digimon are fire based and vorvomon is like the main digimon on there i don't remember what subgenre metal uh metal one <laughs> tyranomon can fit in could be metal empire it could be a couple others i'll list some names there maybe of what he could fit under either way uh tyranomon on a dim i'd really like that because i think he's cool if anything, if you would do like a dual kind of a set, it would be like, you know, Tyrannomon and whatever can evolve into Aegistron. And then, you know, they can jogress into Rust Tyrannomon like they do on the 20th. I think that'd be really, really cool. And being able to raise him on here with a brand new sprite, he'll look super cool. I, I'd love that. All right. All right. All right. All right. This one, especially now, stings a bit. Because, I, like I said before, I wrote this list before they announced any of the other dims that they released so far. One of them that I wanted, obviously, was Guillemon. Guillemon's getting a dim. He has a dim. When they announced a Tamer's dim, or the Tamer's dims in general, they have Digimon from Tamer's. Okay, obviously, you know, the main crew. We got Guillemon, Ranamon, Impmon. Of course, can't forget Impmon. And last but not least, Cyberdramon. Or Monodramon, if you will. Look, I like Justimon, I like Monodramon, I like the story behind the Digimon, I like the Digimon itself, I like Justimon a lot, he looks like Kamen Rider, I like Kamen Rider. But I was a little salty that Terrimon was not in there, he's like the main core, like you did the three and then Impmon is usually what we get. Uh, instead we got Impmon, Gyomon, Renamon, and Monodramon, which I felt was a little weird, I just think it's a little weird. I'm not upset. I'm happy that, you know, they're all getting their, especially Monodramon's getting his day in the spot. Like, finally, we finally got, like, official art for its baby one and two in the Pendulum Z. That was not that long ago. We did not have, like, official, like, VPET reference book art of Monodramon's baby one and two. They were, like, art from, I think, like, design sheet from, like, Kamers way back in the day. It's kind of strange to me. So, I am happy, but I was a little upset that Terramon did not get a dim. So I'm assuming they're saving Terramon for a bigger release dim. So I'm still going to say it's still one of the ones I want. So hopefully it does eventually happen. But Terramon is a dim that I really want to see. I love Terramon. It's one of my favorite Digimon. He's freaking adorable. I think he's great. The Vmon dim has set precedence of putting Armored Digivolutions inside of the dim so we could see both gold rapid mon and normal rapid mon one you can just recolor it save space that's you know makes it easy for bandai and two i, I do like gold rapid mon more than his normal or the other green version and then of course you have saint Galgomon and i guess whatever else maybe that's the reason why he wasn't picked for these dim because there's not really three megas that you could get from terrier mon it's just the one which is saint Galgomon. I don't know. But even if you were to do a dim like this, I think it'd be really cool if they did a, a, a dual release, you know, or a set, a volume, uh, whatever you want to call it. It would be Terrymon and Lopmon. I think that'd be really cute because one, they're twins, they go together. Two, Lopmon hasn't really been on any device that I can remember other than maybe the X3. Terrymon X and Lopmon X were on there, but those are the X versions. We haven't gotten like the normal base version of these characters on any v pet so i think it'd be really really cool if we saw them on the the vital brace this is so the the rest of these three are all like my waifu picks i was gonna set these under one but i think they could honestly all be their own thing so or maybe they could either way one of the biggest ones um i think a lot of people would like to see is like a rosemond dim rosemond I'm putting it like I guess we're tiering waifus now. We'll do that eventually. Waifu, Digimon waifu tier list. If you guys want a Digimon waifu tier list, let me get 
50 likes on this video and we'll do a Digimon waifu tier list, all right? Rosemon, I think Rosemon would be a really cool dim. Again, a lot of people's favorites. A lot of people like Palmon in general. Palmon hasn't gotten a dim yet. So either we can get Rosemon through Palmon, Rosemon through um, Lilimon. What was it? Lilamon? Lalamon? I think Lalamon. I'm thinking of the one from Sabres because that also involves no Rosemon. So there's a couple avenues we can get this one. Uh, a floral based dim card would make sense. You could have a dual release. Uh, again, make it a set because you could have uh, Lilymon, Rosemon, or whatever the fuck, I can't, uh, names are escaping me, especially the, I'm really bad with the, the floral ones, either way, Rosemon and her Jawgrass partner, Lotusmon, there we go, Lotusmon can evolve into Rufflesimon, you can have a Rufflesimon, you know, Jawgrass, it's something that they haven't done a lot yet, where we're getting, where we're getting, like, Digimon that Jawgrass into something obvious, like, we, we've gotten it with Omnimon Zort and Omnimon, but that's really it so far. Hopefully, dim sets will have, like, a Jawgrassable Digimon between the two. It just makes sense, but they haven't done it yet. Making, like, a Rosemon one with Lotusmon, and then they evolve into Rufflesimon, it would just make sense. Or just put Rufflesimon in the dim itself. Either way, I think that'd be nice. I like Lotusmon, she's really cute. Rosemon's obviously really cool, too. And Rufflesimon is just a just beautiful design. I love that design. Next up, a lot of people's favorites. Again, this could be something like the EX set where it's just like a, a Gatomon dim, but we could get an Angemon. I, I do like Angemon. Angemon's really, she's a really beautiful design. A lot of people love Angemon. Uh, one of her promo cards right now costs like 80 bucks. It's ridiculous. A lot of people love this one. She's a really nice design. She is really cute. I do really like it. And of course, we can get like Crusader Mon as Omega. We can get um, like Crusader Mon. What the hell am I talking about? Uh, well, we actually, I mean, maybe we could. You could shoehorn Crusader Mon in there. I think it'd be a pretty cool uh, Mega for her. But I'm also thinking, of course, of uh, the name escapes me. Wow. Fake fan over here. What the fuck? What's her name? Wow. I'm totally biking on her name. I'm Googling it. I don't care. I have to, I have to think something's gonna bother me all day. Ophanimon. <laughs> How did I forget that? Ophanimon. That'd be really cool too. Put Ophanimon in there. Maybe Ophanimon fall down mode. Who knows? That'd be really cool. Angemon Dim. I think it'd be great. And you could also match this with the next one we're gonna do. You can't have... You, you can't have Angemon. Now, especially without Lady Devimon. Lady Devimon, oh my god, let's talk about some hotties. Lady Devimon, super hot, super stupid hot. Love Lady Devimon. That'd be a cool dim too, because you can make her evolve into not only Mastemon if you match it up with the uh, Angemon dim, if they do that, but you could also have top tier waifu, bar none, I don't care what anyone says, Lilithmon. I was gonna just say Lilithmon be her own dim, but it would kind of be stupid that they feel like they that, that makes sense lady david one evolves into little one why wouldn't she i think that'd be great so you know you have angela like i said the last one they have lady david so you have all the evil babes you know you got lady david mon or just evil people in general so yeah i know asking oh i'm all fucked up i'm sorry the there we go okay camera froze so i don't know where we left off either way i was rambling anyway either way asking for Brand new Digimon, I understand it's kind of asking for a lot, in my opinion, but I would like to see it. Even if we can't get something like Impulse City where all of the Digimon are brand new, I do like what they're doing with the Volume 1 set where some of the Digimon in there were brand new that we've never seen before on both dims, on both the Arctic Blizzard and Volcanic Bang, right? I don't remember the names. I keep forgetting those fucking names. Either way, those the volume one set does have brand new Digimon on it that we've never seen them before. So it is nice to see that. And I am happy that we are, you know, seeing just new Digimon sprinkled in here and there. But my number one pick is just to reiterate, at least one more dim that has all brand new Digimon that we've never seen before. Be really cool. So that's it for me. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Again, if you haven't subscribed, please do me a favor and subscribe. If you like these top 10 videos, let me know in the comments down below. Let me know what is one of your, like, one of your fan picks or top picks for a, a dim in the near future. Hopefully, by the time this comes out, we don't, like, find out that everything I pretty much asked for has already been released. But even if it does, fuck it. I mean, that'd be kind of cool. Let me know. 
down below what you guys think of the list what would you add what would you take away what do you want what's your number one pick like the video if you haven't share this with a friend if you would like to i do have a patreon thanks to my patrons who shout out to my patrons they're right here i really do appreciate the support that you give me especially in these times i really really do so i appreciate it if you can't support the channel in that way that is fine feel free to click a video at the end of the end screen any of those videos that are mine click them watch them watch some of my videos watch the ones that you already saw let me know what you think about it if you haven't commented on it already that does help too, just watching my videos, honestly. If you watched it all, this video all the way to the end, you honestly, uh, you have my undying uh, support. I really do appreciate that uh, because just watching the end of the video is also a really big deal. So yeah, that's, I think it. I don't think I have any announcements or anything crazy to make. So I'll see you next week. Oh, God, I burped. Bye.